All right, just checking out the uh, sprinkler setup I uh, just finished. Essentially, it's uh, lashed to a chair over there, and uh, I've adjusted it now so it pans across all the uh, plants, and I think I'm getting pretty good coverage. Anyway, I think I'm gonna run it for like maybe I don't know. I I might run two times a day, uh, but a, a shorter. Um, shorter duration. Um, I'm just, I have a, a timer that, uh, that screws into the hose and, uh, uh, lets you set a, basically a schedule, so. Um, I have to leave town for a week, so this is going to be, um, sustaining them while I'm gone, I guess. Uh, I'm hoping that's, uh, you know, enough water to all of them, and, you know, at, at worst I only lose a couple, so, um, yeah, I think it's a pretty good setup, um, I can get down here and shut the part there. Uh, inside here we got a... Um, just a little hose thing. Kind of little, it's like 20 bucks on Amazon. And then this end uh, mounted on a nice little crucifix because uh, it, it died to save my plants. I don't know, there's, there's something there. Anyway, um, but I'm getting good coverage, even this stuff in the back corner, and, uh, um, all the way down to that, that, uh, scotch bonnet by the car, so. Feeling pretty good about, um, you know, that working for what I needed to do. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and show off some of the ripe peppers. <laughs> Got some red ghosts. Scotch bonnets, seven arrows, ties, um, Bahamian goat, Primo crossed with Jay's Peach Ghost Squirrel. They look like these guys. Butch tea, yellow Trinidad scorpions, another Bahamian goat, beach ghost, like there is Genghis Khan's brain, and we got a couple of ripe reapers, that's pretty cool. Skunk red. A few. Neat stuff. Yeah, this isn't the best mounting I've ever seen, but uh, that's uh, wedged in there pretty good. So I'm I'm feeling pretty good about uh, stability for a week. Anyway, um, yeah, fingers crossed. <laughs>